Glycoprotein Factor I is a glycoprotein in vertebrates that helps in the formation of blood clots. It consists of a linear array of three nodules held together by a very thin thread which is estimated to have a diameter between 8 and 15 angstrom A with circle. The two end nodules are alike but the center one is slightly smaller. Measurements of shadow lengths indicate that nodule diameters are in the range 50 to 70 A with circle. The length of the dried molecule is 475 plus minus sine 25 A with circle. The fibrinogen molecule is a soluble, large, and complex 340 to plasma glycoprotein, that is converted by thrombin into fibrin during blood clot formation. It has a rod-like shape with dimensions of 9 times 47.5 times 6 nm and it shows a negative net charge at physiological pH IP at pH 5.2. Fibrinogen is synthesized in the liver by the hepatocytes. The concentration of fibrinogen in the blood plasma is 200-400 mg per deciliter normally measured using the Claus method. During normal blood coagulation, a coagulation cascade activates the zymogen prothrombine by converting it into the serine protease thrombine. Thrombine then converts the soluble fibrinogen into insoluble fibrin strands. These strands are then cross-linked by factor 13 to form a blood clot. FCA stabilizes fibrin further by incorporation of the fibrinolysis inhibitors alpha-2 into plasmin and toffee thrombine activatable fibrinolysis inhibitor. Procarboxypeptides B, and binding to several adhesive proteins of various cells. Both the activation of factor 13 by thrombin and plasminogen activator T Pennsylvania are catalyzed by fibrin. Fibrin specifically binds the activated coagulation factors factrixa and thrombin and entraps them in the network of fibers, thus functioning as a temporary inhibitor of these enzymes which stay active and can be released during fibrinolysis. Research from 2011 has shown that fibrin plays a key role in the inflammatory response and development of rheumatoid arthritis.